Boris Johnson's former ethics adviser says he resigned last night because the Prime Minister put him in an impossible and odious position over a plan to risk breaking the ministerial code. In his resignation letter, Lord Guite says he came close to quitting over the Partygate scandal, but it was a request for advice on a separate matter that left him with no choice but to go. Lord Guite says the request would have meant a deliberate breach of the ministerial code. We'll be analysing the implications of his letter with our political correspondent live at Westminster. Also this lunchtime. Interest rates up again to one and a quarter percent, the highest in more than a decade. The leaders of France, Germany and Italy are in Ukraine today in a show of European support for the country. The actor Kevin Spacey appears in court in London, accused of sexually assaulting three men. And hot and getting even hotter, Britain's heat wave expected to peak tomorrow with temperatures of 34 degrees Celsius. Coming up in the sports later in the hour on the BBC News Channel, the Premier League fixtures have been released for next season. Manchester City start the defence of their title against West Ham. Hello, good afternoon. Boris Johnson's ethics adviser, who resigned last night, has accused the Prime Minister of putting him in an impossible and odious position. In his resignation letter, Lord Guite said the Prime Minister had asked him to consider measures understood to be about a trade issue, which risked a deliberate and purposeful breach of the ministerial code. Lord Guite's letter also says he had come close to quitting over the Partygate affair. Well, in response to that letter, the Prime Minister said Lord Guite's resignation had come as a surprise. Our political correspondent, Nick Eardley, has the latest from Westminster.